So happy to be out the house though. Can't lie. Quarantine was rough. You know. I was I was bored. She called me beating off. I know. Has that ever happened to you, bro? You ever been? You ever been caught? No? What time you do it? More of an afternoon guy myself, you know. She helps me finish the day strong. I was pissed when I got caught too. Like, I wanted to die without anybody ever seeing my beat off face. You know? And I was mad of how mad she was. Because I offered it to her first. But she said no. I was like, cool, I'm gonna go read. I thought we knew what that meant. But he reads with a boner? Come on, man. This is why she was mad. She was mad because there was a laptop in my bed. She thought I was watching a porno. And I was. Like, what the f I think I beat off to your face. Come on, let's be reasonable. <laughs> I was trying to explain to her, man. I don't really watch porn at all like that. It's not because I'm mature or I think there's something wrong with it. It's just that all my favorite porn stars, they left the game. You know the ones who grew up with? They all gone, bro. And I'm a relationship guy, man. Fuck these new girls. You know, you know it's fucked up when they leave. They don't tell you. They just go. Porn stars should announce their retirement like athletes, man. You got fans, baby. You know? You got fans. There's this one young lady named Michelle Tucker. She didn't drop a new video in like five years, and I got worried about her. I thought she tore her ACL, right, baby? Maybe she's fucking overseas. Turns out she quit. Now she sells herbal life. This is a true story. Another one died not too long ago. Very sad on multiple levels. Because she got a lot of great clips, but I can't. I can't watch no more. I can't. I can't beat off to no ghost. I can't do that shit. There ain't no Ghostbuster man can be out there. Beat off to spirits. Please. 